two days ago, the Lord blessed my family with a grandson. His name is Jaden Daniel. And right now he's fighting for his life. They're transferring him to a larger hospital on the other side of the state where they can uh, monitor his breathing and keep him breathing. They were going to uh, send a chopper for him, but it's too cold. It's like five degrees out, and there was ice on the rotors, so they couldn't do that. So they're sending a ambulance from Traverse City to Alpena to pick him up and then take him back. It's going to be like a seven-hour process. I sure would appreciate it if you folks would keep us in your prayers. I'm doing all I can to fight keep my family together underneath all these attacks from the devil. He just does not like what I'm doing. Well, I don't care. Because my God is stronger. And with your prayers, we can defeat him. He's not omnipotent. He's a little bitch. We need to put him in his place. So call on Father God. Call on Archangel Michael. Bind that bastard. Keep him away from my family. I'll keep you all updated. There's 14,000 of you, 14,400, almost 500 by now. That's the that entire heavy division of God warriors. And I expect every one of you to get down on your knees and pray for this little boy. God, he's so precious. Please pray for Jaden Daniel Powell. He's just two days old. Pray for my wife who broke her foot last week. I've been carrying her around. <laughs> the Habitat for Humanity is coming to build us a ramp, but until then, I gotta carry her out to the car. <laughs> devil does not like what I'm doing and he's making it as difficult for me to live our, my life as he possibly can we need to stick it to him pray to Father pray to Michael pray to the Virgin Mary protect my family Thank you. And as always, God bless, Semper Fi, and Hoorah. Remember to share this everywhere you can. The more prayers we get, the better, obviously.